Hey friends, Coach Maria here with The Herbal Flower. Um, if you haven't already, please do me a favor, subscribe to this channel because there is a lot I have to share and you will not be sorry. So jumping right in, um, I just wanted to have a little conversation with y'all um, about being vegan and overweight. Um, most people think when you go vegan, you're just going to shrink down into the skinny, skinny person, be malnourished, and not get the vitamins and nutrients you need. Um, but on the flip side, you can become very overweight when it comes to the lifestyle of vegan, veganism, um, or whatever you want to call it. The reason people are so swollen um, and overweight when it comes to the vegan lifestyle is they're not looking at what they're consuming. Please remember, just because it's vegan, it does not mean healthy. That's my slogan. I'm going to live by it because I've seen healthy vegans, unhealthy vegans, um, and it's all about how and what they are eating. So when you see an unhealthy vegan, I want you to keep in mind, or if you are an unhealthy and overweight vegan, keep in mind that you are eating probably an increased amount of processed foods. When I say processed foods, I'm talking about your vegan meat, vegan chicken, vegan fish, um, Beyond Meat burgers, Impossible burgers, fast food restaurant french fries daily, right? You're drinking soda daily because it's vegan. You're, you're having alcohol every day. Some alcohol is vegan, beer, vegan, certain ones. So as a vegan, I'm, unha I'm unhappy because I'm overweight. I'm overweight because I'm eating poorly. I'm eating poorly because I got a lot going on, right? So when you wake up in the morning, you're having, uh, you know, your vegan egg with some toast, um, maybe some hash browns, you're eating it consistently. And each time you're consuming this processed food, the scale is going up and up, right? So um, I'm not going to keep this video too long. I just wanted to put this out here. When you are vegan, you have to make sure that you are still eating well-balanced. When I say well-balanced, I'm all for a cheat day. I get it. It happens, but a cheat day can't be every day. It's just that simple. So you need to make sure that everything is balanced. How do you balance your food every day? Make sure you're having some type of smoothie, a green juice every day. Eat a salad every day, fruit, veggies every day. If you're eating that every day on top of drinking the minimum amount of water, which is, I got some sitting here. Um, this is 32 ounces, but making sure you're drinking 62 ounces 64 ounces of water each day if you're doing that you you have the foundation of what it is to be healthy the foundation that's not all that it takes to be healthy or um, for weight control however you have the foundation if you have a rough foundation process you're you're living off of processed foods every day stuff that you can pop in the microwave um oven foods, no raw foods, no raw living fresh foods, then of course you're going to be overweight. Of course you're going to have um, or feel, um, of course you're going to feel sad maybe. Of course your mental or emotional um, health is not going to be on point because you're not eating live food, real food. You're eating all the processed foods. And therefore, the outcome of that is being overweight. When you're overweight, it comes with different elements, um, diseases that will um, make your health decline. So, friends, the point of this video is if you are vegan or if you're not vegan, you're thinking about going vegan, or if you are a meat eater, whatever you are, whatever your journey is, whatever your lifestyle, you have to eat well balanced. It's no question about it. If you're not eating well balanced, it's going to have a um, a number of issues that's going on within 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 self within your body, um, probably within your mind, within your spirit. You never know. Um, just speaking from personal experience. 
So um, again, friends, I just wanted to share this really quickly with you. If you haven't already did so, give this video a thumbs up um, and stay tuned because I still got this series coming up for you all. I'm thinking about dropping it on Sundays, Sundays, Sundays. But don't hold me to it because that might change. But again, friends, thank you. Um, have a great day. Give this video a like. And I will see y'all in the next video. Ciao.